What's up? Good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 6. Here's the update. Denise went all the way down, got the keys, paid a fortune for the cab. Sorry, I didn't get the keys. Got the car. Searched the trunk. No keys in the trunk. She finally got back here. We were like, oh my god, we're going to have to replace this key and that key. Like our P.O. box that you see listed down below. She had a key for that on there. Our civic address mailbox. Like all this stuff. And then we were here. Denise was back maybe 20 minutes and bing! They found our keys and her gloves at the venue. So today we're going to go down and get those. Thank God. Because replacing a car key slash fob is oh expensive very expensive so anyway that is a happy ending to what was a very tired and hungover day but at the event at the event last night i just thought it was so cool that they sang me happy birthday with the little cupcake so anywho um i think it's time to open some advent got it just because you want to say good morning sweet pea good morning after sweet your, pea after your crazy day um i'm doing laundry right now and now we're doing Advent. Here we go. Yikes. What? Well, it's so heavy, this okay. one. You, you know, hold it look pretty, you. Don't mind my wrap. That's just because of the hernia. Okay, I'm going to do this right like this so I can put the box back in. Throwback Thursday. That's all it says, a Throwback Thursday. But it's today's Thursday. Throwback Thursday. Post a photo of your wildest adventure. They must be talking about people that aren't really that wild because my wildest adventures cannot be posted on a public site. I hear you. That's all I'm saying. Hearing you. It is an eye pencil, crayon coal eye definer in black. I will wear that today. Put, put my little box back in. Little kids used to do with their smokes. <laughs> This cool kid still does it. <laughs> Not with smokes. Obviously. <laughs> My pens. And we'll do the Sephora. Oh, look, day five. It's like it never even came out. Tim was that good when oh. he opened it up. I say destroy it, baby. Day six. Ooh, Kat Von D. Kat Von D had her baby. I saw a picture of her breastfeeding last night on the, the internet. It is the very famous Kat Von D uh, lip, liquid lipstick. I'll get Denise to read the name later and let you know. I'll wear it today so we can see what it looks like. See if she just grabby gets that. Outlaw. Outlaw. Cool one. And this is the Becca Velvet Burning Primer. That can't be burning. Velvet Blurring Primer. Oh my god, even with my glasses, uh -oh. it's getting crazy! Yeah, 15, oh! <laughs> you know what I'm gonna need? I'm gonna need those Junior Soprano, like, big, uh -oh. big reading glasses. Yeah. So yeah, cool, I will try those out today. I'm very impressed with this Sephora calendar so far. It's funny, it's just a classic black liner and red lipstick, it's a very cool combination. So it's kind of neat how the body shop thing today and the oh. Sephora thing goes hand in hand. I am loving these teas. Yeah. And we're drinking them every day. Unlike before with the little pots, we didn't always get to them. Uh -huh. There's five. There's six. Mm. Wait, 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 wait. There's nine. Oh, it was six to me. Yeah, where's six to you? Six to me right here. Nine to me, I should say. Uh-oh. That's all right, Will. Uh, so we have got... You always have to read it because I'm upside down. Alpine Punch. Alpine Punch. I wonder if I should put some Alpine beer in that. Not. Yesterday I declared I'm dry now for a month. Uh, that was a lot of drinking around the birthday, so I'm not having any more booze for a month. But I will enjoy some tea later tea. today. Here is Mama. And she'll build these sometime today, maybe. Maybe today or tomorrow. Today or tomorrow, yeah. We're trying to get the house back in order today. Snow and dude. It's a snow, dude. Yeah, dude. They're not going to be hard to build. There you go. Thus far. And your... I have to say, Lego is lackluster so far this year. Yeah, it is a little bit, eh? Might be my last year, kids, so don't <gasps> get mad at me. Uh -huh, unless I come up with a really cool one. Because... 
matches my shirt. It does. Uh -huh. Oh. Tell me the story about Jack and Ori. Shall I begin it? There's oh. nothing in it. Here we go. It's called Organic Dream On. <gasps> cool. I will not. I will not sing the Aerosmith Dream On. I was on. waiting for you to do it. Dream On. Dream On. <laughs> Time for the puppers. Oh, it's starting to snow. Come on, let's run. Got Sherwood today. Come on, kids. This way. Happy, happy dogs. Happy, happy puppies. Get going, you. Get going, you. Get going. You little rascal. Who are you growling at? Come on, bro. So this park is only like uh, two minutes up the road from us, so... Pearl doesn't like to walk very much right now. She likes to run in the park, but she doesn't like to um, turn this around. She doesn't like to uh, walk up to the park anymore, so I drive them up. How nice. Hang on, drop the glove. glove. I think I lost enough things yesterday. I don't want to lose any more stuff today. Um, so yeah, we're here. They love it here. We go into the woods. Come on, babes, this way. Nice little path. Babies. This is the park where I've uh, encountered oh, many of wildlife, fox, coyote, or yeah, coyotes. Uh, one when Chopper was alive and we were so close to it, like within like 20 feet of a coyote in one early morning. Oh, easy. And uh, my flashlight warded off the, the creature, but I think it was more afraid of us anyway. Um, outnumbered, really. And uh, so like there is a den up here and the, this, uh, park backs onto a uh, cemetery and I think that in the cemetery uh, I walk through there there's a den that a uh, little young family of coyotes go and there's like uh, was a red tail red tail hawks in there they're huge geez like they're like, like they're bigger like bigger than bruiser I think uh, so I've seen them I see foxes all the time but so this is the part of the park that backs onto that and uh, it's the closest to our place for me to get some wood action when I need to get in my trees and some some uh, nature. I need nature every day as much as I can. A little medicine. So do the puppers. Get going you guys. So yeah, you've been I've you've seen this park many times in our vlogs. And I got a lot of still pictures on Instagram as well. So this is it. This is a part of the trail that I come down through and there's some backyards that um, are backed onto this and there aren't they isn't that nice I have your own like door to come into there from your backyard with these little fences so it's fantastic what you doing they planted some new evergreens here I don't know the plan of that it doesn't even, doesn't even make sense but anyway um because they had stuff here that try to grow and this doesn't grow just going down here explore but I love this place Oh, having a little doo doo. I gotta pick that up. Isn't this beautiful in here? Nice little spot. Very quiet up in this area. Not too many people come up here. Nice spot just for us. Soft floor, soft floor of the forest because of the, the needles. But uh, these are pretty old trees. They creak a lot when the wind's up. It's kind of nice. Where she go? Where she go over there? In case you're wondering why Bruiser doesn't wear his. He doesn't wear his sweater or jacket right now because uh, it's way too warm for him. It has to be like uh, a blizzard out or um, heavy rain and he'll put his rain jacket on. Uh, he doesn't like to be wet and cold but he can he can actually withstand the cold like a lot. But he hates it. He won't move if I put his sweater on. He stands there like he's broken. So that's why he doesn't have his on right now because it's like Pearl needs it like even if it's like, like a, a, a heat wave outside. She gets cold very easily. So here. Hi, monkey. Yeah. Oh, you 
like it. Oh, Bridget's doing his thing. I gotta pick that up. Hang on. Can you see the snow? Oh, uh, I think I'm one of the very craziest people on our face here that nobody likes snow, but look at this. Like, how can you... It's so beautiful. Look at it. It's not fun to drive in, and when other people are crazy, you don't know how to drive in it, and it's crazy when, you know, accidents and stuff happen. I mean, that's... I just like... Like, the snow is just beautiful. Look at it. It's a powdery stuff. It's thick. I love this stuff. coming down heavy now. I got all my errands done today on foot and, and by car, so now let it come down if it needs to be. Being outside in it. Snow coming at ya. Oh, if I can kind of catch it. Here we go. <laughs> I triggered it. Mama Denise yawns right before she turned the thing on. Of course, it makes me yawn. Uh -huh. But it, I, I did. I got myself a little worn down over the last few days. So today, I, I have them still in my pajamas, and it felt good to just kind of lay low. Denise went to our PO box, and I got this cool card from Danielle in Halifax. Isn't that cool? All the makeups. All the makeups in the form of a Christmas tree. Thanks, Danielle. I thought that was the coolest card ever. I'm, t you know, I'm totally keeping that. Right? To, to, it's got like a little texture on it. I'll be shoving that in one of my planners. It's so cute. Here's another beautiful card. Um, Sandra, my friend Sandra, gave me that for my birthday. That's very cool. And yeah, it's just like it's um, it's like decoupage. Like this is stuck on, and that is actual cork. Very cute. Then, at the mailbox, I got a book from Penguin, which I'll talk about in a book video. I got a box. The box was from Jane in St. John, New Brunswick. I was like, oh, it sounds like maybe a broken Christmas tree ornament. I opened the box. I should have had the camera running when I opened the box. Because <laughs> I opened the box and I started freaking out. Denise is like, what? What? I'm like, powder flush! Powder flush! She's like, what? Powder flush! Do you remember I did a dedicated video to Benefit saying, please Benefit, for the love of the glitter gods, bring back powder flush. So my first thought was, oh my god, they brought it back. Right. Um, but then she tucked a note in saying that she watched my declutter videos, which inspired her to declutter. And she found this in her collection, but check it out, people. I opened it up, everything was sealed. This was still in the plastic. The little insert was still inside. This was still sealed up. It's not sealed up anymore because I just opened it. And she had said something like, maybe you want this for your archives. For my archives? I want this to wear it. Like this is, this is one of my favorite products of all time. And I just couldn't believe how quickly Benefit got rid of it. But I remember the one that I had lasted me a long, long time. So this is going to keep me happy for way over a year to come. I cannot thank you enough, Jane. Like, I wish you, I should have had it running. So you could have seen how much I freaked out. Like, this, I don't understand benefit. Like, they came out with this too soon. They came out with this at a point when everybody was like, Put powder on your under under eyes. Never, you know, like pe highlighting wasn't what it is yet, and setting your concealer or even baking wasn't what it is. Now it's all the rage. I really feel if they came back with this now, that it would be a hit. But maybe, anyway, maybe they will. I got mine. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you so much for that. I, it's a mess. I've been writing out Christmas cards all day. Um, and trying to get my planner piece set up for January. Uh, you know, I just do so much planner stuff. And uh, I'm just trying to, like, streamline a bit. And I'm also realizing I was keeping, like, old, old inserts that... Saying to myself, oh, I'll redate them. I'm never going to redate them. You know, it's... That's, that's the hoarding mentality. That's how you end up living in a place with dead cats. <laughs> so, anyway. I'm just trying to get rid of that. I got... I got my, well, I put some of the candles out, but I've got a nice kind of collection of candles 
burning and yearning over here. That twisted peppermint is so pretty. Uh, not just the candle is it, so pretty in pink, but look at that label. It's just such a pretty one. So yeah, we're just kind of laying low, guys. It's uh, it's a low-key day. Tomorrow, oh my god, I'm so excited. Tomorrow night, we're going to the Toronto Symphony Orchestra. They're playing Home Alone the movie, but the orchestra will be playing the music live while we watch the movie. That's so awesome. So cool. And then we're going to the Glad Day bookstore after that for, there's a, like a drag, uh, like a drag race, a Toronto drag race thing. First there's a comedy show, then a drag race, then a dance. So we're going to that, have some friends meeting us there. We will take you with us. Yeah. Um, I think it's not super late yet, but Mama Denise, maybe we sign off the vlog for today. Yeah, I think so. And uh, we will have a more action-packed vlog tomorrow. On one of these vlog days, I am going to include a what's in my bag because I want to change out the bag I'm using and I want to show it to you before I do that, so stay tuned for that. Thank you so much for watching. I promise I will not be in the same pajamas all day tomorrow. See ya.